Hey guys, welcome back to another adventure with the family. Today we're heading out to Turtle Bay Resort on Oahu's North Shore. And we decided to come out this way because we wanted to check out the new Alaia restaurant. And this was actually the first time we've been to this resort since it's been newly renovated by the Blackstone Group. It's really gorgeously done. I couldn't believe how relaxing and almost spa-like feel you had when you walked into the lobby. It was just beautiful. From the architecture to the furniture they put out and the lighting details, it was just really beautifully done. And you can't beat that stunning view of the ocean. Right off to the left when you enter the lobby, there's this little infinity pool or pond, how you would call it, because it's really just a fountain. And then you can see the sweeping ocean waves of the Cavella Bay. It's so nice here. I hope one day we get to stay here, but today we're just coming to have a look around, see what it's all about, and hopefully have some yummy food later on. You sneezy! That's right, good job. Hi. Oh, look at the pool down here. Look at the surf behind that. And once you walk out past the bar and the bungalows, you see the close-up view of the Cavella Bay. Now, for those of you who don't know what Cavella Bay is, it is the bay that a lot of movies are shot at. So if you've seen Hunger Games, that main scene where they come out of the beach, that was shot at Cavella Bay. Also shows like Hawaii Five O and Lost have shot there. So it's a very iconic place, even though it's kind of off the beaten path and you don't really see much of it. There is a walking path that goes around the outside of this hotel. So we just had a little walk around and was looking at the ocean views. So Turtle Bay sits on a point. So on one side you have Cavella Bay and the other side you have Kutlima Cove. And the surf out here is great, but you have to be careful. The waves can be very rough and very big. And there's a lot of jagged rocks. So those rocks, although they look not so scary up close, they're knife sharp. So you have to be careful when you're out there. But when you go further past that, there is a nice little beach, beach where hotel guests and even the public can go and enjoy the sand. It is such a beautiful walk around this property. It's so many good pictures you could take along this walk. Picture spot too, right there. Look at the turtles. Look at the turtles. That's a drink. They make a drink in there. And when we went to the Alaia restaurant, we decided to get the buffet. And although they had a lot of good menu items, we decided to get the buffet because it kind of had a little bit of a breakfast. This is the chocolate. I love chocolate in the morning. Can you hold your plate straight. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you want frosted flakes? Special K or corn flakes? Mm -hmm. What's this? Mm -hmm. What's Special K? I think you'd like frosted flakes. I Strawberry or waffle station. Okay, the waffle station. Okay, what? Let's get a waffle. Oh, look at that. You want waffle? Put some cream. Oh, oh some whipped cream. Hey, can I have a taste of whipped cream? No, not till we get to the table. Okay, that's enough. That's a lot of whipped cream. Yeah, this is a lot. Too much. Yeah, okay, come with sprinkles. Come. That good. What? Yeah. We got sprinkles. And a little bit of chocolate. And chocolate chips. Okay. Chocolate chips. Chocolate chips. Oh, that's good. Oh, 
Let's get you one crispy bacon. I'm done with my food. Yeah, wait, why did you put it on a waffle? It, it's gonna be cold. No, I'll just move it like that. Perfect. There we go. Now what's in here? Ooh, these are like little quiches. Okay, okay. carry that. You want scrambled egg? No, you're good? Okay. Okay, watch your step. Step. Watch your plate. Hold it straight. Hold your plate straight. <laughs> I hope so. There was enough choices here for the little one to pick whatever he wanted and my favorite part was they had a coffee station where you could pick any kind of latte flavor you wanted, all you could drink. That was so fun. Decaf. Oh wait, no. Vanilla. Okay, let's see what we <laughs> my other favorite of the buffet was the fresh fruit now if you're coming to hawaii and you go to any buffet go for the fresh papaya because that's the most expensive and if you see all those lovely carbs like bagels and and pastries don't get it because you want to make sure you save room for the expensive stuff like the the lox the salmon the eggs, the bacon, and especially the fresh fruit. And after we left Turtle Bay, we decided to stop off at Ted's Bakery on the way home, but they're more known for their cakes and pies, so we decided to check it out. And it wasn't as busy as it normally is, but although there were quite a few people there, uh, their pastry case was quite full. I there were so many different things in here. I couldn't decide what to get. They had also these chocolate chantilly cream puffs that look so good and these strawberry cream pies. But we had to get something from the cake refrigerator because that's what they're known for. And then in the end, because I couldn't decide, I decided to get some day-old pastries and call it a day because I know the kids were hungry. But anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.